This year, social media has become a new business strategy. The National Retail Federation says 47% of retailers plan to increase their use of social media to boost holiday shopping this year. But how do you get started? A new Plymouth company is helping businesses develop a social media game plan. Reporter Shannon Slatton shows us how they do it. Oh, so you've got your Twitter's feeding right yep. to your blog. Okay. You Caroline Melberg stays ahead of the curve because she likes to. I was on LinkedIn before people knew what LinkedIn was. That was way back in 2002. These icons are really nice, aren't they? She was ahead of the curve on Twitter, too. You need power Twitter. Melberg started tweeting in 2007. I was just always very interested and fascinated by the tools that are coming out. So we need to blog about it? Now Melberg has teamed up with Cindy Linus to form a company in Plymouth called the Social Media Incubator. Our job at the Social Media Incubator is really to help manage social media to get a better return on their investment. And how do I incorporate and strategically do all of this so that it makes a difference for my business rather than just being a waste of time? We'll post it to our website. Businesses come here wanting guidance, and the Social Media Incubator offers this advice. First, have a plan and find out which sites are best for you. You may not be the largest out there with the number of followers, but if you're doing it strategically and you're getting that message out and it's coming back to your brand, that's when you'll see the return on your investment. Then, start a blog. Blogging is a way for small businesses to really show customers what they have. This also helps develop keywords that internet search engines pick up and direct surfers your way. And I like how you added the share. Share this the button. share this button oh, that was really on. nice finally stay on top of the action while any one site may disappear the concept of social media is going to be here to stay and chances are if your clients aren't socially connected now they will be 96 percent of post baby boomer generations are already on a social networking site we're just going to continue to watch how it changes and evolves and it, it literally evolves on a weekly daily basis it's it's real time the social media incubator predicts the next big social media wave will be a social search engine that allows people to search what topics are being discussed in real time. And Mike and Jen, this is important information for marketers, but is also becoming more important for consumers too. Most of the Black Friday tips mm. came out first on social media sites. Just trying to stay current could be a full-time job. Yeah, <laughs> Keeping up on all those There's things. There's going to be no way to avoid it, even if you fight it. I That's guess. Right. All right. Thank you.